Okay, what are we doing here? We're going to change a 110 outlet, and uh, we got a little problem with this one because we had an arc plug, and we're going to switch it out just to make sure that we got the right thing. We got the exact same one. We got Jan Vonderbond from birthdaycomp.com. Certified electrician. I'm going to need a screwdriver for this. All right, Jan, explain exactly what you're doing right now. Just testing to make sure that there's no electricity in here because I would have already electrocuted myself, but luckily there is no electrical and it's always good to what turn off the breaker oh no i need a bigger one than this what the hell am i going to do with that i don't know that's what your girlfriend said <laughs> all right so we come over to the screwdriver area and uh oh yeah there we go that's a bigger one hey you make birthdays awesome dude yeah all right so now what are we doing we are going to disconnect the three wires all right this is the ground down here at the bottom all right, so we're disconnecting the ground. The ground is disconnected. All right, good, that's disconnected. We will now disconnect the neutral wire. That's the neutral wire. And now the hot we will take the hot one, which is labeled by the black screw here, which matches the black wire. So you don't screw up because they're color-coded? Okay. What, what was that thing? That's how you get open the box? Yeah. What do you do with the directions? I just throw those away. Okay, so what you're going to do with this is return this to Home Depot. Obviously get, faulty. Get your money back. Save that because we don't want to throw it away. Okay, now what, what are we going to do first? Um, it looks like we're going to put the black wire back where the black wire came from. Okay. Into this. Oh, wait a minute. The guy told me uh, at, from the thing that you got to make sure you get it on the screw really tight yes that is the key to any electrical installation especially with high voltages so is that tightening around there or should we tighten around the screw that is the only place you can tighten so this is professionally done Bijan is a certified public accountant so if you're ever gonna have electricity done get a certified public accountant because those guys know what they're talking through you can see he's making it super tight because that's how he likes it. Oh, yeah. Now we're going to put the ground down. Okay. Looking good. Tell us a little bit about this, uh, this system that we're putting in here today. This is a 20 amp GFI. And what does that mean? Now, if we were going to do this really well, we would probably... Foxy girlfriend? No, what's me? What are we going to do? We would probably put a, um, what would you call that? Hold on, let's see here. Let's see if this goes into that. Oh. Don't hurt yourself. So that's got a flip thing that protects it from the uh, elements. Again, make sure that you turn off your uh, your fuse box switch that goes to this. I have one fuse that goes to this. It's a dedicated. It's a dedicated 20 amp fuse. Use this for charging my electric car. And see, carefully, but with absolute meticulous detail. What's it say on your back of your shirt here? Make your birthday awesome. Ask me how. Birthdaycomp.com. What's birthdaycomp.com? Birthdaycomp.com is an online directory of local businesses that offer free gifts during your birthday month. Oh, what happened up here? <laughs> I electrocuted myself. Too many turns under the sheets. Yes. Alright, so now we're just putting the box back in there. Now, how do we know the Whose are going to be okay? We had a, um, there we go. We have a bad angle of the dangle here. Yeah, but we're getting it. Okay. Oh. Alright, now I'm going to go over here, I'm going to flip the switch, and hopefully it doesn't explode. Alright, the switch is on, that's spare. Alright, you want to plug this in there and see if it works? It 
looks as if everything's going well. Shall we plug that in and just see? There's a green light. The All right, green light. Let's see. Show me the green light. The green light's down here in the corner. Here. All right, so if that green light is on, that means it's working. Correct. All right, nicely done, young man.